Layers used in drafting fields. Different layers are used in different disciplines of drafting. For example, in the mechanical uh, fields, we use layers such as object line. An object line is to find the edges of an object. Uh, and in this case, the object line is a white color and it's 0.6 millimeters thick. And if we also look at the hidden lines, the hidden lines show lines that we can't see for our viewpoint on the back side of an object or the inside of an object. And, and those hidden lines are a green color and they have a hidden line which is a, a dashed line essentially. And it is a thinner line at 0.3 millimeters thick. Now, if we look at an architectural example, we go at, I look at our layers. Our layers, one of the most common things in an architectural example are walls. And so here we have an A wall full, full standing height wall. And it's a white layer and its thickness is 0 0.50 millimeters thick and you know it's a solid continuous line type we also will take a look at our plumbing fixtures so let's go down and take a look down here and here we have our floor plumbing fixtures Right? These things are like our water closets, our lavatories, our sinks, our showers, those types of things. Things that have water running through them in our home. And its color is blue. It's a continuous line. And its line is 0.35 millimeters thick. So you can see how we have different types of line types and different line weights and different colors that we organize things on. Let's take a quick look at say a civil type drawing. And we look at a civil here and in this case we have things like roads. Um, in this case we have a road, it's white, it's 0.35 millimeters thick. Uh, the center line of the road now is a center line line type and it's a 0.3 millim 0.35 millimeters thick we can also go and take a look at our sea storm underground so these are storm sewers and these storm sewers are color a blue of 150 is their color number and it's 0.5 millimeters thick and we can actually go down to our water. Our water is the actual blue color. It's a dashed line and it's at 0.5 millimeters thick. So that's our underwater, uh, underground water supply. So we use various types of layers. You can see over here uh, some of the names of these things. You might not be familiar with all of these types of things and so that we have a description that tells you about them. So we use different types of layers in different uh, drafting fields and each industry decides on these layers.